As part of your campaign, education is a big thing. What's your biggest priority? I want to use my voice as I have as a parent and controller and as mayor to continue to have options for our kids um, because 10% of the schools are responsible for 50% of the dropout rate. So wouldn't you think those 10% of those schools, you're going to go after those schools and say, we got to make sure we improve them, right? Because if they're responsible for 50% of the dropout rate. Um, that's what we need to do and be very focused and directed at how we improve each of those schools. If you are elected mayor, do you intend on continuing the collaboration between LA and LAUSD in the partnership to help turn around LA's lowest performing schools? Absolutely. Because it is about choice and it is about making sure that you're bringing all the resources possible. And what I've, I've liked in particular about the partnership schools is the feeder program, you know, because you kind of are, are feeding kids up and there's a you know what happens in your elementary school to your middle school to then your high school, there's the connection um, and that everyone is looking out for you, not, not somebody else, but they're looking out for you and how you're going to be able to get to that next level. And the role I believe that the mayor plays in education is critical. There have been many recent findings of high levels of arsenic and cancer risks associated with XA Technologies in Vernon, which possess a danger to, to more than 100,000 people in neighbor communities, Boyle Heights being one of them. Residents of this community have already been found to be at higher risk for many health issues, including asthma and various heart conditions because of pollution due to freeways and other pollutants. As mayor, will environmental issues facing low-income communities be a priority? What will you do about them? Number one, um, to meet with community leaders, uh, particularly to look at um, uh, the studies that have been done that show that kind of impact that's happening in this neighborhood, to meet with uh, not only the owners of the, the company there and the, the uh, leaders of Vernon um, and our state legislators who have, an Im have some role and responsibility specifically for um, that oversight that is outside the jurisdiction of the city of Los Angeles.